it's Morgan with the Wapiti Regional Library. And welcome to another one of our Creative Corners. Today, we're going to become bookmark maniacs. I hope you guys are reading lots, so I want you to be able to have something to hold your page. I have four super easy bookmarks that you could make. We have the pom-pom bookmarks, the paperclip button bookmarks, the popsicle stick bookmarks, and the paper corner bookmarks. Hopefully by the end, you see one that you would like to try. You will need yarn and scissors. Cut a piece about eight inches long and set aside. Cut another piece about 15 inches long and set aside as well. Then take your yarn and start wrapping it around your fingers. You will want to wrap it about 90 times. Cut off the string and carefully slide it off your fingers. Grab your smaller string and place the rolled up yarn on top. Tie a tight knot in the middle. Take your long string and tie it in the same spot. Now, place your scissors in between the loops and cut it. Now you want to trim the outside so it's nice and short. I would recommend doing this over a garbage can. I recommend holding onto your tail to make sure it doesn't get trimmed. Keep trimming until it's a nice round shape. It will take practice to get a nice perfect ball. Your bookmark is now ready. You will need buttons, paper clips, a couple of small pieces of felt and a hot glue gun. Take your button and place it on this end of the paper clip. You want to make sure that this tab is facing down, that way it can grip onto your book pages. Set your paper clip over top of the button and put a spot of glue. Then take your piece of felt and put it over top to help seal it. Let the glue dry and then it's ready to go in your book. You will need tape, a popsicle stick, some paint, and a paintbrush. Put tape on the popsicle stick wherever you don't want the paint to go. Get your paint out and begin to paint your popsicle stick. Once it's dried, peel the tape off. 
Make sure you give it plenty of time to dry before you place it in your book. You will need green, white, and red paper, a cup to trace a circle, a sharpie, a glue stick, and a pair of scissors. Start out by cutting your papers in half. Fold the corner to make a triangle. Then cut off the excess. Fold up the outer two corners. Fold down the top of the triangle. Take your glue stick and put it on the outside corner. Fold the triangle up and over. Do the same with the other side. Take your cup and trace a circle. You will see it doesn't quite come to the edges. You want to make sure you leave those sections uncut or else your bookmark will fall apart. Next, cut a circle out of your white paper that is slightly smaller than the green circle. Cut a circle out of your red paper slightly smaller than your white circle. Glue your red circle on top of your white one. Then take your black sharpie and draw watermelon seeds. Take your scissors and cut your watermelon in half. Glue one half onto the top and one half onto the bottom. You can now place your bookmark on a book. You can use the basics that I've given you to design so many different types of bookmarks. I hope you guys try one or all of these bookmarks.